What is up you guys and welcome back to some more Cyberpunk 2077. So we did something pretty criminal. We sided with a big corporation last time. I mean, does Netwatch really count as a corporation? It, it advertises itself as neutral, but let's be real. Who is really neutral in Night City? But you know what's even more criminal is that you cannot see my cat in the background from this angle. Let me, let me see if I can get you a glimpse. Oh, she's so cute. Oh, there's both of them. They're both right there. Both my cats are there. Oh, no, I messed up the camera. Okay, anyways, we'll fix that in post. Anyways, what happened last time, like I said, we sided with Netwatch. And here's the thing. I didn't side with Netwatch. I kind of explained it. My, I explained it? I kind of explained myself last time. I didn't side with Netwatch because of solely what they did to Evelyn. That's not why. I understand, turn back or be terminated. Oh, he probably, he probably did that for me. I didn't side with Netwatch because of what the Voodoo Boys did to Evelyn. That wasn't my, my thought process because Evelyn did betray them. She did play the game and lo and she lost, you know? You know, we've, we've killed people for, for doing less, for betraying us, you know? So that's not what I hold them accountable for. I hold them, I hold, I have a lot of beef with the Voodoo Boys because they view themselves as better than everyone. Like, it's not just Evelyn that they viewed as trash. They view everyone in Night City as trash. So why defend them? Wow, that is loud. That is loud. Come on, I'll fucking let her go, man. Yeah, that's right, let me go. Excuse me? Who said that? Oh, I really can't shoot them? That's wild. My immersion. Alright. Alright, we'll see. We'll see later. We are to take you to Placid. Hey, yeah, I surprised him alive, huh? I'll find him. I don't sure. need a ride. Yes. Yeah, you drive off scared. You thought I was gonna die in there. But the thing about the Voodoo Boys is they don't see themselves as one of us. As a, as a citizen of Night City. Like, we're all in this struggle, they don't care. They think they're just better than everyone. They see everyone in Night City as trash. Evelyn Parker is no exception. We're no exception because they tried to just betray us and fry us, kill us. So why would I show them that respect? Obviously, I'm gonna side with Netwatch. They, they put a virus on me, Netwatch offered to take it out, so who am I to deny it? Times have changed. We're heading to the hotel, and this map could I'm be- so sorry. Oh. I'm so sorry. What are you sorry about? I don't even know you. Oh, this place sucks. Ooh, okay. Alright, let's go. But now that my rant is done, I, I've i switched to glasses recently. <laughs> I, I'm, I know, I'm just talking about anything. I'm trying to make my way over there. I've switched to wearing my glasses a lot more recently because it's just so much more convenient. I know there's probably a glare. That's why I'm acknowledging it. I know there's definitely a glare at certain angles. So if it is too much of a problem, just let me know. And I'll try to fix it, or I'll wear contacts again. But right now, it's just so convenient to just put on glasses and not have to worry about my eyes getting dry while I stare at the screen, you know? This song, this song is kind of good. This is going in my playlist. I can't believe I forgot about this song. Cyberpunk really has some hits on its hand. I hope this goes in the vinyl record they're going to release. I see to wait you up this day. Okay, that's where I'm going. Gosh. Which way? Ah. Oof, I got a new chair. I don't know if you could tell. Makes my camera look a little grainy, but it's super comfortable. It wasn't at first. I was like, did I just drop that much on a 
on a bunk chair, but now it's good. Where's Placide? Sub loser. What the fuck you do in the GIM? Living. You were to hack the agent, not cut deal with him. Mmm, yeah, about that. Every merc you hire, try to set him up. Oh my yes. god! You believe that fachis? What he say? You say, or I open you. See with my own eye what Boom Crawler done. All right, bet. I fucking dare you. Nice. Asif, we must head under. I do not know what Netwatch plans, but they are not done. He's he bodied that shot. Agents? He really took they that. Shoot her in the head. I do not know what they put in her. What corruption is in her system? You don't know what is in there to begin with. How much is it worth? I know. I stand here. Only a normal filthy Ranyan. Ali, See what I mean? See what I mean? Why why trust them? Why trust them at all? Come with That's me. right, walk away. Don't trip, you won't be able to get back up. You must be Brigitte. Hard woman to find. You have something for me. Um, I guess. Glad you're alive. You know about the biochip, don't you? If it is functional, we offer you good price. For I don't need money. I don't need money. Biochip's not for sale. Plus, do you know good to take it by force? It's in shitty shape already. Mm. I haven't found a single soul capable of getting this thing out of me without scrambling my brain. You commissioned the heist, so I figured you must know something. You've gotta. How do you know all this? How did you find us? I have no idea. Evelyn Parker. Name ring a bell? Ah, the doll. The whore. You found us because she led you to us. She has proved not completely useless after all. Girl, watch your mouth. Listen, can you help me or not? Yes, of course, but not here. We will go to the crib, where you must give us access to the jeep. Once we have the data we need, we will do our best to help you. Mm hmm. Seriously. Haven't done enough for you already. There is no other way. To remove it, we must first examine it. Because if you fuck up, you're left empty-handed? That it? I gave my word. We will help you. <sighs> All right. Then, after you. I don't blame them for hating Evelyn or saying bad things about Man, her. You guys sure seem to love this place. But, honestly, you don't give off a strong religious vibe. I don't blame them for, like, talking smack about Evelyn. Because Evelyn did betray them, so it's like, oh, she didn't prove completely useless. Like, all right, fine. I don't like that they say that, but it makes sense. I'd probably talk the same way about someone who tried to betray me, so... It is what it is. I still don't like how they view other people, though. We left our guards on Aiti, yet we are strong here without them. Like, that's just business to them. This way. Still try to kill me, so not cool for that. Definitely so not how a come fan. didn't know about the biochip? He didn't recognize it in the scans. Few of our people know about Compeki Tower. But Placide, he is. Yon bet de ba. Yon bet de ba. What's that mean? That didn't translate through my chip. You gotta. Yeah, translate that one for me. Where are we going? Soon you will see. Don't you get hot with that light lifesaver on? Life vest on? That's like aluminum, right? <coughs> we're good, we're good. We're glitching the out. The did not notice the biochip in you. Strange. Did you let him scan you? Huh? No. Why? It would complicate our work. Right. They have to know about the chip. Is this an old subway tunnel? No. Part of the transcontinental maglev system. When all states were connected. Like the net, it too crumbled after the war. Hmm. View a courant. 
Netwatch would have to know about the chip because that's who Evelyn Parker was going to sell it to. And you are Nobu, so they had to know. We're lucky he didn't scan us. He couldn't have known, but man, <laughs> we got lucky. They would have snatched us up right there. Bon. Bon. We take you into the cyberspace. No better place for you to interact with the construct. Mm. How do I know I'll come back? Do I get some guarantee? You'll be inside our data fortress. Under watch. Under your watch. Right. If you knew what is out there in the cyberspace, you would not be so choosy. I mean, with you watching me, though? How's all this any different from plain old net running? The interface show you the data layers direct from the net. Readable, of course. But the basic runners see is only a map. They cannot see beneath the surface. Their tech, it is too weak. Hmm. Okay, hang on. Want to know what you need Silverhand for first? We wish to contact Alt Cunningham. We know she and Silverhand were close. Alt? The relic which Arasaka held close. It is our only lead. Alt Cunningham. Heard of her. Yep. Oh. Where? From who? <sighs> Johnny himself. From Johnny. Though, granted, not much. Johnny. All right, V. Guess you better tell her. Tell her what? About us. Construct's active. Let's me and Johnny shoot the shit every now and then. Mm-hmm. We will look at this, too. What, you think I'm hallucinating? Found myself an imaginary friend? Little is known of how an engram might exist within a human's neural network. Tell you one thing. It doesn't shake out well for the human. Right. What's your plan to contact Alt? We try to cut out a unique piece of Silverhand's engram from the biochip. Alt will know it. If something of the human is left after years beyond the Black Wall, she will answer. Well, what? Said nothing about breaking through the Black Wall. Well, now you know. Direction yeah. connected. Hmm. Connection stab. Johnny, what do you think? Johnny, looks like you're the bait. You okay with that? Yeah, whatever. Just do what she says. Okay. Really wants to get to this alt. What exactly do you want from alt? All of you. Alt, the only one, can give us safe passage past the Black Wall. When the change comes, we wish to be on the winning side. The change? When the Black Wall was built, everyone think the ice would be enough. Keep the wild AIs out, the way. But technology advances. It cannot be stopped. And now, catastrophe come again. This is sure and soon. The corporations, they do not see the danger. But we, we will be ready. Hmm. The Black Wall. What is it, exactly? I mean, I know. You know only what the Netwatch tell you. The final bastion against the post-war AIs. The great victory of humanity over chaos. That would be your Saturday morning Netwatch propaganda. But the Black Wall is an AI itself. The boundary condition let no thing pass through, either way. If the AIs thought like people, they would call it a traitor. Hmm. So they just think it's inevitable. Like it's gonna take over humanity or something? Oh, come on. Not the tub. We must prepare you for the dive into cyberspace. You are not accustomed to the neural demand. Don't try and get out of this, V. Just do what she says. I'm not about to sizzle with you. Okay. Jeez, Johnny, let me be a bit skeptical. In my position, if you were me right now, you'd be pretty hesitant. I know that. Why you wait? <sighs> the ice will melt Let's do you this. for your decision. Okay. Oh, man. I feel like I could do that. I've never gone in ice water before, but I could do it. All right. Johnny? He's gone. Okay. Oh, my God. Don't pour more. Johnny. Johnny, where you at, man? She's zooming. Looks familiar. 
Looks like when we first saw Johnny. Who's that up there? Oh, there's two. Where are we? This is our BBS, Data Fortress. Bridge to the Deep Net. Hmm. It's, it's all so alive. So real. Cyberspace moves, breathes at all times. The interface will adjust the ebb and flow of data to the capabilities of your brain. But you, you are an exceptional case. Seeing something more than I am. Yes, the cyberspace, it is always trop belle. So, what now? We can begin. All is ready. We enhance your link to Silverhand's neural network for a short time to grab the fragment. We must find the data on Alt. Alt alone. This should only take. Brigitte? Oh, here we go. Here we go. We're back as Johnny. Where are they going to put us? This is all the way back. We're baby Johnny. What's happening? We're gonna we're about to be baby Johnny. 2013. That means I could be as much of a jerk as I want. Let's go! Oh, you can't do that. Out of line. Way out. What next? Where are you gonna take it? Gonna drag a corporal rat on stage, make him kneel, down with gas, and light him up. Oh my god, it's loud out here. Hey Carrie. It's not your pants. You're no solo act. Over here. You know exactly why I do it. No, nah. -uh. To piss Arasaka off enough so they'll give you a case of deep muscle lead poisoning? You kinda are, though. Only one to have a problem with me. Cause and probably the guy that we just shot. Up to here. They're done thinking they can get through to you. You're fucking whack. Let's go. I'm Johnny. But I'm the only one with a vision. Sorry. Sorry, I don't want to push so you. Unless you got a better one, like I said, go fuck yourself. Oh. Hey. Fuck. Is it the concert? Why not? Let's do it. Let's do it. Hmm. Said you weren't coming tonight. Not if I can help. Oh my god. Changed my mind. <laughs> this is about to be too Look much. Oh, hot and bothered. Oh no, the sunglasses indoors are coming off. Oh my god. Oh my god. Aw, oh, look at Johnny, he's so cute. Too bad about his personality. I don't wanna be here for this. I shouldn't be here for this. I shouldn't be here for this. I don't wanna see all this. I'm getting a little too personal with these memories right now. Can we be done, is that it? Fade to black, a beautiful fade to black. And they lived happily ever after? No. Oh no, I can't be here for this! That was certainly something. I don't have a cigarette, but I'll drink some water. Oh, she's got a plastic hand. Goodness gracious me. So, you want to order some food? Shame that's that. Some DoorDash? Always got to shit all over it, don't you? 
Any moment that might actually feel good. Your moment. Why the hell not? You can be such a bastard sometimes, Johnny. Some pizza, maybe? Man, are you on my ass today? Not just today. How is it subtlety goes so far over your head? Weird for an artist. Why couldn't we have this fight before we did it, you know? That's the problem with couples today. <laughs> Things were swimming. What? Change your mind? Eats at my gut. Because you knew what you were signing up for. Look, if you were just another charismatic, narcissistic douche canoe running around after his dream with his head up his ass, I couldn't care less. But? It's all a lie. That concert, samurai, all of it. A ginormous fiction. Hmm. You're not a rocker boy, Johnny. Face it. Ought to join the wired wackos on the corners, frothing at the mouth as they scream death to Arasaka. Cool. I see. Think you've seen through me, do you? Wow. You know exactly what I mean. Look at you, faking it even to yourself. <laughs> Probably what you're best at, faking it. Yeah, she was, she really did kind of see through that. Huh. Mm, you're afraid. You and Carrie both cowards. I alone have the balls to stand up to Arasaka, and boy, that terrifies you. All of you. Of course, Johnny S. Misunderstood by all Night City. That's it. That's the problem. <laughs> I like her. I like that she kind of calls him out for his nonsense because i i i'd all i'd be doing the same thing calling him out like calling him out like this i swear it's so <laughs> she says it in a way that it's kind of hard to interpret but i'm pretty sure that she's just she's calling him out for the same stuff that i do johnny silverhand is in love with his persona this idea of johnny silverhand that he's created for himself he's an idol and he stands up against the system but there's so many deeper layers to that and a lot of people hate him because a lot of a lot of people who play the game don't end up liking him because he only likes to show that surface level side of him but when you start to understand his backstory and where he came from and what he did and what he went through it all starts to make sense there's so there's such a deeper level to that to that narcissism uh, and there usually is but like narcissists they only like to show that that mask that they put on that persona that they put on and it terrifies them when people can see through it and that's why i think he's kind of acting out in this moment but he just wants to play the idol he wants to play the persona and he's fighting right now because she's seeing through that she's calling him out on it and he does not know how to handle that to him, it's a defense mechanism to be fighting with her right now. But she she get, she knows him probably more than Johnny knows himself at this point. Because when you're that narcissistic, you're trying not to think below the surface. You're trying not to reflect on yourself. And you want to be that persona. And when someone says, oh, there's more to you than that. You're not just some rocker boy. You're not this. You're not that. That's terrifying. It's like, how do you, you, you think you know me? I don't even know myself. So I get why he's fighting. I know he's going to start being rude. I know he's going to act up just because she's keeping it real. And she's probably not saying it in the best way. But, you know, they probably had this fight millions of times before. So, you know, it's probably just at its boiling point. You're confused. We came here to fuck each other's brains out, not analyze mine. Sorry for all the talking already. No, we're only 20 minutes in. I think we're done for the day, so you can fuck off. See, I thought... Hmm. Let's just see how nasty he can be. That this meant something, that we're close? So close you can give me shit about everything I do? Got quite the imagination then. 
Well, that'll happen. I know I'm choosing these bad options, but they're there for a reason. Got somewhere to be. I mean, it all ends the same, right? These options are there for a reason because he's capable of doing this. Ran out of boosters. Can't kill because there's one. Typical. Blaze away. Down the rebel path. Playing again tomorrow. Let's get out of here. Join us for a drop. Silver Rocker. Another time, Chumbas. What if there won't be another time? Huh? Johnny boy. Go, run! Hey, where do you think you're going? Let go of me! You better not jump with me. Uh, I mean, we really can't change the past at this point. We just have to watch this here. play out. Let me alone. But it still sucks to see. Johnny! Don't let go of me! That same cat. Why are they all hairless? Really did you, didn't they? Oh, hello. Johnny Cage. Dude, we're lucky we survived that. Come on. Rise and shine. Milt. Been a while, Johnny boy. How long did you say? Two weeks since I last cobbled you up? Hmm. How's it look down there? Oh, man. Well, shove so many tubes up your ass that you're about two mods off from pissing espresso and milk froth. <laughs> Ew, also that's so gross. Also synthetic liver. Old one was looking worse than a paper bag full of shit. Great. Now I can live forever. Just as well. Feels great. Thank you. Man, did I miss you. Ugh. Bullshit, you gonk son of a bitch. Didn't even bother to call. You were supposed to be back for your follow-up. Kids like a son to me. So I see. Where's Alt? Where's who? Woman who was with me. He brought you and you alone. Fuck, they grabbed her. Nobody saw it? Ask your savior. Said his name was Thompson. Hmm. Arasaka, wasn't it? Uh, it's always Arasaka with you. Cause it always is Arasaka. We gotta talk. All right. It's spit and glue, but she's holding tight. Get some rest. Even a few hours, that the stitches set at least. Uh-huh. We know we don't got Johnny. time for that. Yeah, fuck it. You won't listen anyway. Yeah, we know. I'm a huge fan of your show, Johnny Bravo. So talk. They wanted her. You. He was just home. And you just stood there, dick in hand, gawking and dreaming of tomorrow. Would have shredded us both if I jumped in. You see the guy's reflexes? Course not. He was that fast. Tech like that, you don't find in a dumpster. Hmm. So, what are you after? Chasing down a story? Fresh for the scream sheets? That why you scraped me up off the pavement? Now, had my story. 
but then some cats tossed her in the back of a van and sped off. Ah. You, uh, aim to do something about it? She was your output, wasn't she? So Johnny's just kind of a bystander in this situation. He wanted alt, they wanted alt. We're just kind of the man in the middle. But watch, he's gonna think we it's all about up. him. It's all about him. Yeah, see, this was about me. Because it can never be about someone else. He's so self-oriented, it's almost ridiculous, but that's who he is. Alt's kidnapping, it's collateral shit. They swiped her to get at me. Ah, uh, Johnny. You even know what she does for a living? Girl's one of the best runners around. So, one of how many? No, only linked to Arasaka's. The fact that Johnny Silver ends. Oh my god. She's been god. working for ITS lately. Wrote some real smooth black eyes for them. Not to be duped in either sense of the term. He's so self-important that he thinks the fact that he sleeps with Alt Cunningham is the reason for this this insane kidnapping. Still waiting. If they wanted to get rid of Johnny, they could have just done it in the alleyway. It's so self-centered this this thinking. I want to lean on Thompson. You see these biceps? Golly. Let me let me live just once. Arasaka wants her. Abduction was a standard intercorp extraction. <laughs> Nothing more. I'm so tall, finally! Why can't I be this tall as V? Give me that. Oh, is that my profile? On the thing? Hold on, let me look at that. I know that says his name right there. Look at Robert John Linder. Yeah, there it is. We need to hurry up. Huh. Okay, alright, alright. Hang on. Alt was gonna meet you tonight. Mm-hmm. Said she could use my help. Wasn't kidding. Sokka tried this before, you know. Except Alt got lucky. Slipped through their mantis blades. Hmm. Telling me she was afraid. And she went to you. Yep. And frankly, I'm starting to see why. Right, because you're a reporter? Okay, so what are they after? Soul killer. An AI. Sound familiar at all? Course. Urban legend with the shittiest name ever. It's no legend. Soul Killer's real. And your chumbas at Arasaka just hired the runner who wrote it. Take that in. Sokka with Soul Killer to do with as it pleases. Grim, my man. You even imagine that, Rocker? Arasaka'll be unstoppable. Soul Killer will flatline any runner who comes close to even trying to scratch its ice. Seen it happen. Not an iota of physical damage. Nervous system or anywhere else. No sound, no fury, no stench. Just all of a sudden, brain waves cut out. As if someone pulled the plug. Or ripped the soul from the body in question. Huh. Well, we know all about Soul Killer now. Dang. Cool. Tell me the rest on the way. Do I hear extreme doubt? Probably. Oldest, tritest tale in the world. Arasaka was out to provoke me. Johnny! It worked. It's one of those moments where you just want to grab him by the shoulders and shake him. It's, he's so self-centered. So what'll it be? Coming with? Where to? Arasaka Tower. To grab Alt right back. He cares. He clearly cares. You and me? You out of your fucking mind? He clearly cares enough to be making this plan to rescue her. So he's not self-centered in that sense, but it's just self-centered the way he thinks Still waiting. the world is out to get him. Swing by the Atlantis on the way. Got some chooms there. All right. Sorry about the driving. I'll be in the car. Can't wait too long, though. You'll wait as long as you need to. Okay, Johnny. Where the hell's Rogue? Faster. Sit. Stay. <laughs> Dude. Johnny gets away with too much. Alright, let's 
The Atlantis. Silverhand. Oh, cool. Got an IOU here with your autograph on it. Here you go. I guess it's your lucky day. Ah, much appreciated. Want a drink? I... Oh, I, gu I guess so. I guess I'll just take one. I don't even get the option. It's fine. We got a new liver just now. You seen Rogue? She's upstairs. But I heard you two weren't, uh... Well, you heard wrong. Oh, great. Already... Already off on the wrong foot with everybody. Fucking fuck. Johnny, give me a hand here. Oh? Heard you weren't talking to me. Dunno. Seem to be talking to you. Make a good argument. How about now? Now you can go fuck yourself. <laughs> I wonder if these characters that we're talking to, like the bartender and this girl, are a part of some old campaign from the cyberpunk roleplay. Like, I know a Morgan Blackhand was the creator's character once. And so is Spider Murphy. So I just wonder. Oh. Yes? Get out of town before it's too late. Want some advice? Oh, I I just said I heard someone call my name. Okay. Never mind. But Mike Pondsmith, his character was Morgan Blackhand, and I think his wife's character was Spider Murphy that they created during one of their campaigns. So I wonder if some of these people are like past characters that they kind of snuck in as well. Oh, stinks, Engels. Got a private meet going on in there. Rogue back there, too? Yeah, just. Yeah, yeah, private meet, so you said. Promise to be super unobtrusive. Oh, not a very good bodyguard. You know? God, I hate this fucking town. Hate these slimy fucking fixers. Hate this fucking bar. Hmm. Where would you rather be now? I could take you away, out to the lands where my clan roam. There aren't too many jobs out there, but we'd find some other useful ways to kill time. Getting the weirdest deja vu now. My answer's no. No today. Tomorrow. Who knows? Someone flirting with my side woman. Johnny. Uh, so glad to see you. Lucky I found you. Wasn't sure if you hadn't left town. We're waiting for a client. One who values discretion. God, I love her voice. Mm-hmm. So much so, he himself didn't show. No point in sitting here, then. Hmm. You still mad about that thing? What thing, Johnny? That you fucking lied to my face? Put my peeps on the line? Or that you were fucking three other women behind my back before we were through? Oh, Johnny. Johnny. You know, when I hear that, I really don't want to play as you. New partner. Gotta say, that famed charm of yours? Overhyped. Or maybe just dulling with age. You have a job for us, Rocker? Or are you mainly here to run your mouth? That's deserved. Johnny's Johnny's for the streets. Look, our history, yeah. I know. But we don't really have time for it. Feelings. I'm in no hurry. Johnny really said, don't get emotional. I got a job. Typical. That's it. Urgent. But I got the euro. How much? But out. This isn't your biz. He is now. Rocker just pulled out his wallet. Don't you get it? He's not here about any damn job. He's fucking with me. Last so time this he... time, you'll be smarter. Ooh. Take your eddies up front. So, how much, Rocker? Man, you see Rogue now getting kind of like overlooked and talked around. It's such a contrast to how she is now. She's now considered the queen in 2077. It's just such a weird thing. 
It's so weird to see someone talk down to her like that. It's our Osaka. I'll understand if you'd rather not. If you wanted my attention, you just earned it. But if you're aiming for a friends and family discount, I'm not your man. Mm. Corpos, riding in on them hard. You two do that for fun. For fun, but not for free. We leave right. that to rocker boys. Mm. Money's no object? It's important. Name your price. Ah. So you are the maid of money. Or you think we won't live to collect. Hey. Either way, Rocker, you're coming with us. He wouldn't have it any other way. Deal. That it is. Urgent indeed. Shit, Johnny. Didn't oh. you had a fucking tail? Mr. You didn't see him coming in? You're coming with us. What happened to our bodyguard out there? Sure. Let me just finish this. Nice. Oh. Oh. He just gave up? We didn't we didn't even shoot him. Alright. Oh man. Hey! Leave a little for me! I haven't handled a gun in this game in so long. I forgot I can shoot guns in this game. That's how long it's been. Oh, oh. Who'd you piss off this time, Johnny? Yes, fucking own it! Crouch. Crouch, Johnny. Oh my god. There's so many. Whew. I'm not used to fighting like this anymore. She said get wrecked. I'm way ahead of you. I did not mean to jump over. I meant to crouch. It's been a minute. Whew. Where's the elevator? I have not had to be... I have not had to be this tactical since I got my San Devas stand. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Elevator? Thank you. Elevator, quick! I'm already there. Left to scrape up when we're through. Um, hello? It's gonna take much longer. Got There'll trouble be more at the heat. bottom. Bet you thou. Y'all couldn't push the button for me? My god. You're tall. <laughs> You're tall. I'm parked outside. You coming? Thompson's waiting for me in the car. Who? Media, you wouldn't know it. Uh, yeah, he looks like Nick Cage. The Johnny Bravo looking dude. Hey! Did I say Nick Cage? Johnny Cage. He did not look like Nick Cage. Thank you. Thank you, Rogue. Go, go, go. He running? Come here. Flank. Oh. Oh. I'm just that good. I'm just that good. Oh my god. That healer can come back. We'll be back. Thompson! How do you get my keys? Let's get the hell away. We'll be right behind you. Thank you. I don't know how you got my keys though. Okay, okay, okay. Let me out. Arasaka. Let's they hit go. The car, we're fucked. 
Yeah, they're they're definitely gonna hit the car. I hate to break it to you. No way, no way. Thank you. I have no idea what the hell she saw. Hmm. Not half bad, Dad. I guess. Aw, oh, my window. Now what? Oh my window. Gotta lose him, quick. Next right, take it. Alright, I'm glad I'm not driving. Yeah, I'm good. Sunglasses inside at night. How are you driving right now? Clear of them. I'll park somewhere. We'll chat. I've heard that before. Every Tinder date ever. They always try to get you. That one. All right, where's my girl? Um. Right, so who we gotta pull out of Arasaka? Old Cunningham, net runner from ITS. Oh, yeah. The tower. Ah. What's it taking her there? This gets better by the minute. How you wanna play this? Either of you donks got a plan? Yep. Distract him. Make some noise. Hmm. We'll play a gig. Set up right under Arasaka's windows and crank it loud. Blast the pains out. It'll be a gig to remember. I don't know how to dance. We do not as yet have word on the exact number of people hurt in the riots. Oh, that's not good. All reporters are on the scene. I'm not cheering for that. The tower, and they all agree. A psychoactive agent has been dispersed at the site, affecting those in the crowd. All right. It's called the Funky Groove. Oh. We already killed a man I've, I've seen. You recording this whole thing? Uh-huh. Why? Want to say a few words to the folks at home? Do what you gotta do. Hey, TikTok. Just stay out of my What's way. going on, you guys? Today, we're going to be raiding Arasaka headquarters to rescue my girlfriend. I'm here with my ex. Thompson. Know him well? No. No, why does it matter? Don't like the guy? Don't trust him. And medias are bad luck. What? Bad luck. Say someone finds a tape later. A tape of us breaking into Arasaka Tower. Worry about that if we make it out. I mean, is that really... They no, Surely they got their time. own cameras. Surely Arasaka has cameras everywhere already. Surely they know. Come on, reload, Johnny. We good? That's it. Give me a sec. I'll get it open. Cover me. I got you. I Let's got you. This quick. Get ready. Headed this way. Got four headed Get our ready. way. Let's just rush him. I've got a little got a little thing called plot armor. Five seconds and we're in. Ready? That went well. Yeah, I'm ready. Reload, reload, reload. Get that out of here! Don't take yourself with easy targets! Not it? We good? Alright, let's go. Neutralize him! Just finish this quick. I'm impressed! Seriously! Where are my doubts? Okay. Not anymore. This <laughs> is, it's too easy. I kind of love it though. It makes Johnny feel so cool, so invincible. Uh, I went the wrong way. Everyone, move. Anyone else? I guess so. Watch out. Ready or not, 
I'll use my silver hand. Try. Ouch. Son of a bitch. Ouchie. Try this. Huh. Now I see why we brought him along. Why he act like it was obvious? Like you idiot, I brought C4. Like you didn't Three, tell us. Two, one. Why'd I stand in front of the door like that? <laughs> why did I do that? Alright, here we go. Let's this Where's my gun? Well, thank you. Oh. One. Look at this guy! He just dodged all my attacks! On my way. What do I do? Alright, square up then. I'll just, I'll come to you. Don't even worry. I'm reloading! It's right. Fight, fight, fight. Join you in a sec. It's right. Move, rogue. Sorry. You're too late. I would advise you not to disturb her. What'd you do to Alt? I put her to work on a project of a lifetime. Get out of my way. Exactly. Uh. Alt. Alt, come on, Is don't she? do this. Fuck. Johnny. The hell are you doing? Are you still rolling? This is all we can do now, my man. Show people the truth. Won't change her. She is not. Johnny! Stop that! You have to kill him? Uh. We gotta go. Johnny! She's dead. Spit it out before you burst. You probably shouldn't have just started unplugging wires out of her head without knowing what they were doing. It's still rough. Let's get out Thompson. of here. What happened to him? Dunno. Never worked together again. Maybe because you whooped his ass to make yourself feel better. Guy was a vulture. Out to use all from the start. When Arasaka flatlined her. Man, for him that was sprinkles with the cherry on the top. Fuck, he would have killed her himself if they hadn't. Just for his cockrod story. I don't believe that. Never even told me half that about Alt. Really? Any examples? I don't know. That you were a couple, that she wrote Soul Killer, that she's dead. <laughs> How the hell is she supposed to help us now, as a ghost? She's not dead. Managed to escape. I saw the body. Alt fled into the net. God, this soundtrack is so beautiful. You're pushing bullshit. Heard more than my share of tales about runners who ran off to Never Never Netland. Just never thought you'd be the next to tell me one. Don't need you to believe me, long as you do exactly what I say. When'd you find out? When she made contact a little later. And? What did she say? That she was a captain in the Arasaka subnet. But they couldn't hurt her. And she told me not to come looking for her. Hmm. What? Why? This one time, she wanted me to just let it go. Because enough people had died for nothing already. 
That's considerate, but you know you tell Johnny not to do something. It's not gonna work out. So, what did you do? Got my hands on two thermonuclear charges. Of course. Then headed back to Arasaka Tower. Yep. Rogue went with you. Again. I paid her well. Said it yourself, she was the best. Had her pick up contracts. But for some strange ass reason, she took a job from a rocker with a death wish. A rocker, forever getting his ass beat by Arasaka. Different times, kid. Back then, Marks didn't normally sell out to corpse. All you had to do was yell, let's fuck up Arasaka, and every last one of them chizzed their pants. Rogue included. <sighs> Johnny, you know that's not why Rogue went with you. He doesn't want to admit that it's like he has any responsibility. So, ready? That he might have used Rogue, might have used her friendship to get her to do what he wants. How do you know Alt's still around? It's been half a century, which you've spent cloistered in Makoshi. Netwatch could have hunted her down years ago. Oh, well, they tried, believe me. But their tiny corporate brains can't handle a free AI that knows how people think. They were busy looking for her in the Crystal Palace while she was building the Ghost City for Kang Tao. Hmm. Who do boys think they know where she is? Beyond the Black Wall. Where nobody can touch her. And Brigitte's primed to go there. Break through. Just to contact Alt. Talk to her. Ka ching <sighs> There's so much to unpack here. So much stuff that we just learned about Johnny. This whole facade. As I've said, this whole facade, this whole persona. I'm just a crazy rocker boy with these beliefs that Arasaka needs to get taken down. Here's my crazy manifesto and my, my message to the world. I'm, I'm just the guy who did what needed to be done. It was personal. They took away some of the he cared about. And on top of that, it's always been personal beforehand. When he was a kid, joining the war. Fighting, fighting wars for companies who didn't care about him. Losing friends in that war. Fighting for companies who didn't care about them. It was always personal. Johnny's just not someone who's ready to unpack that. He wants to believe that he's doing everything for an ideal. But he's doing a lot of this because he's just been hurt. He's been burned so many times by these people in positions of power. Even, even Rogue says it in the beginning, when we first get to experience memories with Johnny. When we tell her, like, oh, we gotta upload something to Arasaka before we get out of here. And she was like, oh, so this was never about taking down Arasaka. It was about your, your groupie output or something. She said something along those lines. So it was, it was partly about your girlfriend that they killed. And he didn't admit to that either. But it's so true. I don't know. Let me let me just continue. I have so much more I could say, but I, I know I keep talking too much. Look at Johnny, he's getting restless. A moment. Felt more like a moment. Felt more than a moment. Sure felt like more than a moment. Saw a good chunk of Johnny's life. And Alt. It is possible. Data connected to Alt are linked to a strong memory trace in the construct. Mm -hmm. Very strong. These memories must have evoked a powerful emotional response. Then projected onto your consciousness. Emotion, yeah. Plenty of that. Mm-hmm. Construct, what kind of shapes it in? Enough data is uncorrupted to convince all it is authentic. What the hell does that mean? So, did it work? Yes, 
We extract a necessary fragment of Silverhand's Angorn. We are ready now to make contact with Alt. First, we must dive deeper. Great. Beyond, there are no waters. This looks safe. Beyond the black wall. You have gone through to the other oh. side. And none have yet returned. Uh, she will be the first. <laughs> you can go first. You can go on ahead. I'll, I'll be right in after you. So, actually, you got no idea what's beyond that thing. But we will know soon. Can't and wait. Shape some sand. Wild, unfettered AI searching for a passage. <laughs> well, good luck. I wish you the best. I held up my end of our deal. Your turn. Before you pass through that wall, I want Johnny's psyche removed. We will not pass through. You will take the code to the other side. <sighs> Fuck. Might have guessed. Never had any intention of helping me, did you? Of course they didn't. It does not matter anymore. These guys suck. To its end. You guys suck. I just want you to know. Don't got much for options, do I? Ale. Tell me to go. How do I get to the other side? Brigitte? <laughs> that is so terrifying. I think I realized net running is not for me. This does not look fun. Alt! Oh. Johnny. V, actually. You cannot remain here. Alt Cunningham. Joris. Yap attacking network la. What the hell's going on? They breached our BBSs. We have nothing to do with this. Netwatch. Ooh. She cannot touch me here. It's really you. What happened out there? Couldn't just take him out? Netwatch was well prepared this time. Gotta be Mosley, the fucker. Hmm. Whoops. What of Brigitte and the Voodoo Boys? I was forced to purge them. Netwatch was exploiting their BBS. Purge? You mean they're dead, all of them? Not actually gonna feel bad for them, are you? Oh well. Should have been nicer. Damn it. I brought Netwatch here. Agent I dealt with must have slipped me a tracker that let him right in. Switch things up on the sly, replacing the Voodoo's virus with his own brand of fraud. Probably how they got to you. It matters not. The entire subnet was destroyed. Alt. You pulled us out of there. That mean you and us were okay? Everything's chill? <laughs> Johnny. I have recognized your engram code, but I do not know why you are here. So you can pay me back for getting you out of our socket tower. Johnny, you're not smooth right me? now. This is Alt. Best net runner Night City's ever seen. Hi. Alt, this is V. You need to save her life. Please. As you can see, Johnny's got it all thought out. But there's the question of what you'll want in return. Netwatch propaganda has been effective. Do you see me as a demon who requires a pact signed in blood? Um... I just want to live. Listen, I'm just trying to survive. I exactly. can't help you. Can't or won't? Can't. To attempt to do so. I would need access to more advanced technology. Hmm. What? But it's your tech. You created Soul Killer. The program I created has little in common with how Arasaka has since repurposed it. Fine. So how about Makoshi? That advanced enough for you? 
If I could gain access to Mikoshi, it would cease to exist. Good. We can work with that. Oh, we'll yeah. Get you inside Mikoshi and you'll help V. Deal? I can work with that, too. Best runner Night City's ever seen can't bust into Mikoshi on her own. I am a well-known threat there. They have a layer of black ice with my name on it. Literally. Kinda like a custom-made prison jumpsuit. I refuse to be caged in there ever again. Hmm. What can you do for me, exactly? Everyone I've met so far says I'm too far gone. By everyone, you mean Hellman? Saburo's personal ass munch? With the Soul Killer resident inside Mikoshi, I will create a construct of you, then disentangle your neural network from Johnny's. I shall then inject your engram back into your mortal form. Hmm. Don't know if I like the sound of that. So, you'll save my life, but flatline me along the way. Your consciousness, neural engrams, will be recorded as data. The rest will cease to exist. The rest? The soul. I did not grant the program its name, but Soul Killer does precisely what it promises to do. Christ, I don't want to listen to this bullshit. V just hops back into her body, right? Nothing changes. Everything changes. You know this well. Honestly, it's worth a try, but if it's gonna just erase me to create another version of me to put back in... What do you expect from me? This I can't fathom. Then it wouldn't really be the me I started out as. So it almost feels a little pointless. But maybe it also depends on how much of us how much of us is far gone like maybe she can just repair the parts that were missing and then transport that back into us i don't know it's the same brain it's the same body it's our memories but if it's just a duplicate of me then the current me still would be dead. The current me would still be gone. It just doesn't seem like that good of a deal at that point. At that point, just let Johnny take over, you know? But V's in it, so I guess I'll be Your in it. Projection in Great, cybers. so we got a plan. But how will you reach Mikoshi? I've created armies that failed to breach it. They were children of the net. There's your problem. We're banking on the human factor. We'll crack a window, slip you into Makoshi. Mm. Johnny embellishes, in case you hadn't noticed. You don't trust him, which is fine. But you have my word we'll slip you inside Makoshi while keeping you out of harm's way. I believe this human factor and I have things in common. I just have to believe that our consciousness our current consciousness will be transported back into our body. It's such a what gamble. What do you expect from me? This I can't fathom. It is such a gamble to assume that, but it's kind of all we have. So let's let's just go. Let's do it. So we agreed. Yes, we are agreed. Find a path into Mikoshi. I shall prepare a program to help you navigate the local net. How will I contact you once I'm ready? This is a BBS address. It will be our secure communication channel. Alt, before you leave, we gotta talk. Just you and me. No, that will not be possible. No. Oh. Sorry, Johnny. He really does want that closure. <laughs> <laughs> He really does need that closure. Couldn't think of a more fitting end. Runner Fox had it coming. Oh, they're all dead, yeah. For <laughs> forgot about that. But we'll worry about that in the next episode. A lot happened. I think I've kind of discussed Johnny's situation a lot at this point. I've kind of I've discussed about his his narcissism. I genuinely do think that he, if he went to a doctor and discussed his symptoms with them he would actually be like diagnosed with some 
some form of narcissism, you know? But this is just, that's just my assumption of him. I'm sure other people have different interpretations of him. And when I say he is diagnosed with narcissism, like that has stigma to it. I, but I know there's a lot of complexity and layers to it. And I've discussed that when talking about Johnny is that narcissists who build this self image of themselves and lie to themselves and lie to others to protect that image, to protect that persona, always have something deeper going on, always have this fear that they're going to be found out, have this fear that they're going to have to face the reality of their situation. And there are people that I actually have a lot of empathy for. So I don't say like, oh, Johnny's a narcissist just to write him off. So I hope no one ever gets that misunderstanding when I talk about Johnny in that way. It's just, it's just a label and I think it suits him pretty well. Just from what I know about the, the actual diagnosis and the, the pain that people who have narcissism, narcissistic, narcissistic personality disorder go through and have endured in their lifetime. Uh, I, I do have a lot of empathy for that. And I, I really do enjoy Johnny as a character. And I think he does care about people. He really does. It's just, it's so convoluted. But I also think that's what makes him interesting. It wouldn't be Johnny if he was just some hero, if he was this, if he was actually this idealized rocker boy. It just, it wouldn't be that complex. So with that being said, thank you so much for watching. I'll, I'll probably definitely be talking about Johnny more in these coming episodes because a lot of lore on him has dropped after this episode so thank you so much for watching there will be definitely more to come i'll see you in the next one goodbye